I need him now. I need a motion to approve the minutes of the meeting held on August 23rd, 2020. Second. seconds. Any addition, revisions, or corrections? The board meeting, say aye. Say nay. Any absentations? The minutes are we at this time will entertain, entertain anyone from public speaks and you can make your way to the microphone at this time. I see one no one from public speaks, so I will continue to press it into report. Good evening again. Although this is an abbreviated meeting, I did want to share that I had the opportunity to attend the agency's all employee in service day at Birth Christian Church. I found the speakers interesting and it was a nice day to be able to gather and to be together. At the conclusion of this meeting, we will go up to the second floor for our board meeting in service. This concludes my report. Bill? Yeah, I just want to provide one update. Uh, today we had a Technology event. Uh, we had, I don't know, about what, 10 to 15 vendors, and we had about 100 people come in and walk through just to see what technology can do to uh, make or assist people become more independent just with the use of technology. So that's something that uh, we've been very focused on. Uh, there is a policy that uh, is for your approval on technology first. Uh, and this is just one of many efforts uh, that the board is taking to utilize uh, technology to assist people be more independent. That concludes the report. Thank you, Bill. Committee and departmental reports are in your board packet. Are there any additional additions or depletions that need to be made at this time? We do not have any old business, new business, or a presentation this evening. So at this time, we will have a review of politics that are stated for fur reading by Connie Colton, Director of Luther, for President of Policy. Good evening, Board. Policy 2.01, Duties of the Superintendent, was revised. Language has been included from the Ohio Revised Code regarding the duties of the superintendent. Also, number six, which, which was in the prior policy, was added to the list of duties and states that the superintendent may authorize up to $25,000 for the purchase of supplies, equipment, and the entering of service agreements. The last item added to the list of duties of the superintendent staff states that any claim over 25,000, but not exceeding 100,000, with the concurrence of the board president, or in absence of the board president, the vice president may be settled. Claims of more than 100,000 require approval from the board. Policy 4.20, full-time, part-time, casual, and sub-employees was reviewed with no changes. Policy 4.22, policy against harassment was reviewed with no changes. And policy 5.24, school age services had one revision. The first sentence of the third paragraph was revised to replace medical or behavioral challenges with the term intense complex needs when explaining the admission and referral process of students. Any questions? Thank you. Thank you, Connie. We will now move on to resolutions.
Good evening. Good evening. All right, so we're, we have the financials for the month of August. We had local total revenues of 289,000, total state revenues of 794,000, and total federal of 642,000, giving us total revenue for the month of August of 1.72 million. We had three payrolls during the month of August, totaling 1.68 million. Total benefits paid of 726,000 and total other expenses of 395,000, giving us total expenses for the month of 2.8 million. Our expenditures exceeded our revenues by 1.07 million. Looking at the bottom for our cash carryover of 60.7 million, uh, we had 369,000 canceled 2021 purchase orders that were added back to that balance. We have 9.1 million in 2022 purchase orders currently open at the end of August, and then a current year date negative financial position of negative 2.3 million, giving us unencumbered cash at the end of August of just under um, 50 million, minus our 10 million in reserves, gives us actual unencumbered cash of 39.6 million at the end of August. Looking at our budget versus actual, just focusing on year to date, we have total revenues of 31.4 million, which is 63.8% of what we expect to receive for the year. Total expenses at 33.7 million, which is 60.39% of what we expect to spend. Um, our target is around 67%, so we are below target. Over on the far right, our available budget, which is mostly made up of personnel expenses, is about 13.05 million. Our prior year encumbrance activity, uh, this report has remained unchanged. We carried over 766,000 in 2021 POs. We have paid 397,000, close 369,000. So we have zero 2021 obligations remaining um, at the end of August. Now resolution 094722, uh, you can see the three payrolls there totaling 1.6 million and the total week by week breakdown of non payroll expenses totaling 1.1 million. If there are no questions, requesting approval of resolution 094722. I need a motion. Nikki moves. I need a second. Mock second. All in favor, say aye. 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 Opposed, say nay. Any answer to? And financials for August are approved. Okay, thank you. So moving on to resolution 094822. This is to approve and accept the bid of a 2023 uh, yellow bus as part of the second bid for this year. Um, truck sales and service was the lowest and best bid um, at a total of a, a net cost of 121957 we did post this in the camp repository for two weeks, as well as on our website, and this was included in our budget for 2022. Um, this was a rebid. Uh, there was the fees that were added on after we had approved the bid last May, so we had to bid it out. Um, fortunately, the same vendor was the lowest and best bid. If there are no questions, requesting approval of resolution 094822. I need a motion. There are some motions. I need a second. Follow my seconds. <coughs> Any discussion from the end page? Oh, then so. Yes. Okay, call the vote. All in favor say aye. Aye. Vote say nay. Any applications? Resolution is approved. All right, next is resolution 094922. This is to acquire liability and fleet insurance at a cost not to exceed $190,000 for a one year policy beginning October 1st, 2022, and running through September 30th of 2023, secured from Philadelphia Indemnity Insurance and the Shower Group Incorporated. Um, as you can see from our policy limits below, we have received um, the same coverage that we have been. We didn't go out to market this year, and we are, were able to save on our cyber coverage. I think it's the total savings about 16% from what we paid in last year. And you can see we still have the, the $10 million umbrella policy as well as the million dollar per occurrence general liability um, and executive liability insurance policy as well. If there are no questions, requesting approval of resolution 094922. I need a motion. Off moves. I need a second. 80 seconds. 
Thank you. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed say nay. Any abstentions? The resolution is approved. Now we have a second reading of the board policies that were presented at August board meeting, and these will be presented by Connie Colton. Policy 2.18 Behavior Support. This policy was revised to address the change to Rule 5123 um, regarding development and implementation of behavioral support strategies that was effective on October 1st, 2022. Policy 2.31 Technology First. This is a new policy and is in accordance with the Ohio Revised Code. The policy addresses the fact that there are a significant number of citizens with disabilities that, that could benefit from the use of supportive technology solutions. Policy 4.04, background checks on employees. Policy 4.07, job descriptions. And policy 6.06, .06, encryption for all reviewed with no changes recommended. Thank you. Resolution 952-22 provides approval for the board policy to prevent for second reading. I need a, a motion to approve. Piggy moves. I need a second. Anderson seconds. Any discussions? All in favor say aye. Aye. Opposed say nay. Any expectations? Board policies are approved. I now need a motion to adjourn. A second. I need a motion to adjourn. Calvin Lang moves. Thank you. Seconds. All in favor say aye. Opposed say nay. Any action? We now are adjourned at 6 15. Okay. Good night.